All right, we're here with head coach Ed Jackson after the 3-1 uh, to one season finale loss to Fresno Pacific. Um, you guys battled hard out there. Maybe tell me a little bit about uh, what you saw to your team against. You know, you guys have been playing Fresno Pacific t twice this year. What does that mean? Well, we did a really good job tonight. Uh, you know, I really thought the girls did fight hard and um, made some great plays here and there up and down. Uh, they did a great job in the first set, got off to a good start. You know, Melissa, uh, one of our seniors, uh, she came and, and played and got to start at the setting position tonight, and uh, I was really proud of her performance. She did a good job and finished on a great note here uh, at Academy of Arts. And uh, you had three seniors out there tonight, uh, Melissa Chang, Angela Heath, and Janelle Burnett, uh, all three of which have, you know, had their moments this season. Uh, maybe talk a little bit about their performance tonight and over the rest of this year. Well, they all you know, made some contributions tonight, did some great things. Um, Janelle did a spectacular job defensively and uh, helped us. She got really close to that season single uh, or single season uh, dig record. Uh, only missed it by four digs, but uh, she did a great job tonight. Um, Angela just provided a steady performance offensively and uh, defensively as well. And uh, Melissa did a good job of distributing the ball and. Uh, running the offense, and uh, they all did great. They went out on a, on a great note and had a, a great time tonight. And again, uh, you know, after this year, uh, very quickly, you know, playing well against some of the good teams in the conference, uh, what, does that, what does that mean for you guys for the future? Well, it means people, you guys need to start coming out and watching us play next season because we're going to be, uh, we're definitely playing well and uh, we're definitely going to continue to improve. I think the, the team is inspired to want to be great, and they're going to continue to work hard. And I'm really looking forward to the offseason, um, where we can really get down and, and, and into practice and uh, continue to grow and develop. And uh, I think we're definitely going to be a much better team next year, and we're going to just continue to be uh, one of the better teams. So we're going to go for it. All right, thanks, Coach. Congrats on the season. Thanks. Are right, we here with senior outside hitter Angela Heath uh, after her final match as an Urban Knight? Uh, tell me what's going through your head right now and what you're thinking about. Um, everything's just really bittersweet. Like just playing my last game, I'm really gonna miss the girls. We came out fighting the first set, and we fought until the end. And I'm just hands down gonna miss them. This was pretty much my best season here, and I really love them and gonna hope the best for them next season. And uh, you've got quite a collection of things going on here. Tell me a little bit about you know. Uh, your final game here. What is what is all this stuff you're wearing? Um, it's it's per Urban Night um, kind of local Hawaiian tradition. You get lays as a congratulations, and then a lot of the um, alumni volleyball players got me flowers. So just a nice way to send me off. And uh, you know, any any last reflections you have looking back? Uh, anything you want to pass on to the younger guys and the team? Just keep working hard. I mean, the goal is within reach and. You guys will get there. All right. Thanks, Ange. Mm -hmm. All right. We're here with senior setter and oh, Melissa Chang. Uh, <laughs> sorry about that. And uh, after her final game as an Urban Knight, uh, tell me a little bit about what's going through your head right now. What you're feeling? Um, I don't know. I feel very accomplished. And after these long four years, I feel that I finally have went through my journey of playing a collegiate athletics and I'm definitely happy that I was throughout you it would definitely not be the same experience that I would be at any other school being at our school made it just that much better just because when we crush teams and beat teams it was yeah we're in art school we can still beat some people no matter what kind of school we go to and uh, if you have any parting thoughts for any of your younger teammates what do you think you would tell them mm -hmm. Just keep on the journey and keep tacking on those tracks and keep going forward. And I can't wait to come see you guys when I come back. All right, thanks. Thank you.